This is Yo Chicago outside of the Lakeside Loss. We're with Robbie Frankel, one of the developers. Robbie Frankel, I'm one of the builders of the Lakeside Lofts. Okay, and um, you guys are at what stage of you know, the, the building? We have two towers here. The south tower will be ready in about a month, which will put us in mid-May. The north tower, which is right through those windows over there, will be ready sometime in October. And between the two towers, we'll have a garden filled with a lot of uh, evergreen, type plant material that stays green all year, a lot of flowers, and um, should be really nice for viewing. And it, during the winter time, you'll have something green to look at. Uh, we're in the uh, living room, combined living room and uh, kitchen. This is a two bedroom, two bath unit. These start in the mid 330s, and we like to think these are some of the better bargains in town. Everything in the unit is standard. We have upgraded granite. It's uba tuba and it's an inch and a quarter thick. Undermount sinks are standard. We use Hans Grohe plumbing feature, top of the line. That's usually two steps above what most people get, which is mowing. Grohe's next up and then Hans Grohe's uh, what we use. All the appliances are stainless steel GE Profile, which is also an upgrade in virtually every other sales center. And we have custom-made cherry cabinets. Uh, we have a little cabinet maker in Chicago makes them for us. The crown molding comes on there, and they're solid cherry faces. And all this is standard. The floors are uh, three and a quarter inch wide. There's no knots in them, and it's real hardwood. It's three quarter inches thick. Uh, virtually every high rise today uses an engineered flooring, which is a lot cheaper. And when moisture gets in there, they tend to uh, move around a lot. The reason that uh, high rises don't use real wood flooring is during the winter time there's no humidity in high rises and it, it also the hardwood would move around. These units have their own furnaces with humidifiers so they stay a lot more comfortable in the winter. We also use a lot of insulation in the building, most, uh, more than most developers. The outside wall is insulated as well as the inside wall. We have insulation above the ceiling then we have airspace, then we have concrete floors. We also have six inches of solid insulation between the units. So all the units stay very quiet and very warm during the winter. All the doors we use are, are high quality solid core six panel doors. They're not hollow core cheap doors. Uh, high quality hardware. All the trim we use throughout the unit is upgraded. We give it as a standard. Uh, our tile in our bath area goes all the way up. And we have, as a standard, instead of cultured marble sinks, we have solid granite, uh, three-quarter inch with undermount sinks, and we have a three-spread Hans Grohe faucet system instead of a single lever. And then our same cabinet maker makes these solid um, maple cabinets. We also have surround sound as standard in all the units as well as junction boxes in the living areas and the bedroom areas. And we also have uh, cable outlets in all the rooms and a home run back in the living room where all the wires uh, originate from. The five unit, which is a one bedroom and den, some of the features in this uh, unit, we have the same uh, high standards here, the Uba, thicker Uba Tuba, Hans Grohe, upgraded appliances, cherry cabinets, all the units have 10-foot ceilings, and this is a nice unit because for a couple who needs an extra room, the den area is uh, 9 by 10. You want to take a look at the den area, Mark? Uh, you can't really see it, it's dark. So it's a nice big den area, 9 by 10. You could put a big office in here or make this into a baby's room. We also have a half bath in front, which has the maple cabinet with the undermount sink and granite top.
the bedrooms are all approximately 10 and a half by 12. And junction boxes are standard, as well as cable outlet and the upgraded trim in all the bedrooms. And all the units have covered terraces that are recessed, so you can stay out there um, in unless the climate. rains come down. Yeah, unless the rains are blowing sideways, you can sit out on your porch for a lot of the season. This unit has side-by-side, uh, -side, kind of walk-through closets, and again, high-quality bifold doors. And then the master bath, these have six-foot uh, soaking tubs as standard in the one-bedroom and dens. And the tile goes all the way up, and it's uh, an upgraded tile we give a standard 